To balance this equation, lithium plus water yields lithium hydroxide plus hydrogen gas. Let's add the atoms up on both sides of the equation. We have one lithium, two hydrogens, and then we have one oxygen. On the product side, we have the one lithium. We have one hydrogen here plus these two right here. So we need to add that plus two. That gives us three hydrogen atoms. And then oxygens, we have the one. When I have an odd number like this here, it's usually easier to try to get it to be even. So if I were to put a coefficient of two in front of the LiOH, that would apply to everything here. So let's update our atoms. For the hydrogens, I have one times the two. That gives me two hydrogens. Then the oxygens, one times the two. That gives me two oxygens. And then the lithium, I have one times two. I have two lithiums. And I've made a mistake here. I do have one times two, two hydrogens, but I forgot these, and we have to make sure we add those in so we have four hydrogen atoms. Over here, if we want to resolve this, let's fix our hydrogens. If we put a two in front of the H2O, we have the one times the two for the oxygen, so we have to update that, and that actually fixes our oxygens. Then two times the two for the hydrogens, that means they're balanced, but the lithiums don't balance. That's pretty easy to fix though. I need two over here and I only have one. So I can just put a coefficient of two, one times two, that equals two. And it looks like we've balanced this equation. Be careful, make sure you count the hydrogens up. I almost got caught with it. We have the hydrogen here and here. Make sure you count both of them. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for Li plus H2O yields LiOH plus H2. And thanks for watching.